loves my baby, but my baby don't love nobody but me. Nobody but me. Yeah. Welcome back, everyone, to I'm No Genius. We're happy. Can you move? Thank you. <laughs> Restart. Redo. <laughs> nope. Keep no, it going. We, we keep Cut. going. Sorry, your knee was in the way, and I was trying Eli, to get no, my knee in front. This is why you got Could've fired. We gave you no, another chance. No, no I, listen. You can't fire me if I do all the if I do all the editing. We I'm gave sure you we another chance, and this is what happens. Straight, I think instead of point. entering the show, we should intro Adam's state of mind right now. Yeah. Adam's had a rough day. No, let's skip. All right, that there it is. There's Eli, Adam's had a rough of the day. I'm hungry. Adam, Adam's had a pretty rough day. <laughs> Guys, overall though, uh, Adam, I know how you're doing, but Cam, Grant, why did I look at you and call you Cam? Why did I look at you and call you Grant? I didn't notice. It's okay. Right too. I'm offended by it, but it's all right. We'll. we'll how, how are you guys doing? We just got a killer like workout this. in. I'll let Grant go first. Grant, how are you doing? Sick pump. Um, <laughs> sick pump, bro. <laughs> we. Uh, I don't know. Good workout. Yes. What did we hit? The today? old. Little little chest try at the mm. Taze Valley High School back gym. In, back we in the gym. Sync up with the cycles like me, Jack. Shark Paul. emoji, shark emoji, we shark emoji. What? Sync up cycles. We did. Oh, were you guys do all doing legs today? Yeah, we all did legs. It's Thursday. Wait, it's Wednesday. No, it's it's Wednesday. It's Wednesday. Wednesday. Ah, long week. Mm. Tomorrow's Thursday. Mm. You know push, know. pull, remember. leg. Yeah, that's where mine came from. That's where you're at. Is that what you do? You do push, pull, leg. Yeah. What do you, what do, you do? Chest and triceps, back and biceps. And then legs and shoulders, and I do abs so, every day. So, so the, same thing, pretty much. Yeah, that's, yeah, what, we, that's what we started doing, Grant. You, and then, yeah, and then I mean, yeah, well, that's I mean, what, that's what we do. Chest and triceps is basically push day. I did, I had in shoulders there, back and biceps is pull day. Yeah, I know Jack does shoulders on pull day. On pull day? Yeah, because. Mm. Well, I think I of guess. push. I don't know. I don't know. I mean, it's, I I, guess. Same thing. Yeah. We're not fitness influencers, and we're, we have no idea what we're talking Definitely about. Not. But uh, pause. You know who should be a fitness influencer? The same. ringleader at Planet Fitness of the clan. Uh, well, uh, what? Uh, Go deeper into that. Don't listen, don't end the sentence uh, yeah. with that. Listen, one. there's this guy. <laughs> He's <laughs> like five six. Think okay. of Dwayne Johnson with the, the tattoos. In like huge arms. You say five six, and then he's you like say a, think of Dwayne Johnson. No, he's like a five six Dwayne Johnson. Okay, okay. That's the best description I can give him. He's like if Kevin huge Hart arms. and Dwayne Johnson were one. Yes. Maybe okay. Bruce Lee. Is he Hawaiian? Dwayne Johnson. Um. You can some, say some he's Owen. Pacific American. That's a thing. I'm pretty sure. I thought it was a thing. I think. Isn't Pacific Islander American. I think that's a thing. Pacific American. But he's yeah. Asian. He's yeah. Asian. That's, he's that's Asian. what I was looking he's, for. He's Asian. <laughs> and he's got like a, this clan of six <laughs> puny Adam, Adam sized Asians. Like, it's, it's I don't a, know. There's it's just minions. There's some yeah. of them yeah. that like are smaller than me, but they just follow him around. I mean, I would too. Yeah. Like, I know. I'm, I'm about to just join in. It's just a, throw in a wife beater and join in. Just, they all have wife just to clarify on. for the people watching at home, it's a lifting group of one really, really, you know, huge. Deep, yeah, big guy, and then like five, four or five skinny guys that there just. Six have today. we have there we all seen today. him before? Yeah, we've all yes. seen. He's he's a resident. They live there. He, I've been there twice. I've seen him twice. Every time I see him, he's just. I don't even know how to describe it. He's got his shoulders forward all the time. His hair slicked back like a uh, tank from Surf's Up. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> giant tank one. And he's always in slides. Yes, always. slides. Always in slides. Long shorts he's down to the calves. He's yeah. tattoos yes. also. Yes. Like, like he's huge. jacked. He looks good. You can't say anything to him because he will. And then he has the legitimate minions from Despicable Me falling behind him. <laughs> yep. Some of them look like they've been in a gym maybe three times in their life. And yeah. the rest look like they just got out of the Valorant tournament. <laughs> No that's, offense. That, no, Better I yourself. Mean, hey, that's look, what Planet Fitness is for. On this show, we're all about spreading positivity. But I hate that place. But with a passion. Yeah. Planet, Planet Fitness has got some weird people. I told uh, it's these. It's just on my way home from because I yeah. get drive mm -hmm. to Canal. And so. it's free. It's free for our age. For, it's free until you. Whoa. Oh, whoa hey, 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 look. Whoa. Whoa. Hey, man. Look. Big guy. Tomorrow is a big day for me. It's the big two zero for me. I, I, you know. Gonna start paying ten bucks. Yeah. I'm not. I will never go back to Planet Fitness ever again <laughs> after tomorrow. Where are you Just, going? Where, where are you taking your talents? Ohio State. Oh, you get to work oh, out there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I get to work out at OSU. Yeah, after. I would. If I had another option, I'd definitely take. Yeah, I'm honestly abilities. next next summer. Uh, if I've got a 
a, a nice income, steady income, I might join Snap Fitness. Who wow. knows? Wow, yeah. Yeah, did, did you stop joining Snap Fitness, or well, you still got the membership? Uh, so I got a three-month membership, and yeah. I went there at the beginning of August, one Sunday morning. Tried to swipe my card, because that's how you get in. You mm -hmm. get a card, door unlocks. Card didn't work. I realized I forgot to... Uh, mm. to Extend it. Extend it. So, yeah. right now, right, I'm just Sorry. I'm I'm at Planet for the next couple of weeks until we go back. Till you get yeah, dude. We're going back to school here in a little bit, except for Adam because Adam's a full time working we're man. Going back to school. He's a flunky. You're you're going back to school. August 29th. At a boy for a week. Yeah. So, yeah. 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 So we all we all are kind Deep of in this. Class. Yeah, we're all kind of in the same boat here in terms of you know getting getting our education some longer than others, but. Uh, <laughs> It's four years. <laughs> it's it's four years, but just like four, four times weeks. a year. Four four times. Uh, what are, what are we looking forward to most about going back to school? Hold on, let's not jump past the part that it's your birthday. Yeah, I mean, no, no, I don't. What I don't. do you What do you want for your birthday? Uh, rocket let's... ship. All right. Okay. What Midget type? Out of Lego huh? Control. Like what type of rocket ship? Whoa, whoa. Like what Guardians of the up? Galaxy? Like NASA? Look, I want a rocket ship that's a cross between the Millennium Falcon. Okay. And the Starship Enterprise from Star Trek. Okay. And just throw in Hogwarts in there too. Okay. I, want, I want some mystical stuff too. Okay. So I don't. I'm not asking for much. I just want a rocket ship. That's, Can you explain all enough. three of those to me? Uh. <laughs> <laughs> I know the Millennium Falcons from Star Wars. Like St one. Star Wars, mm -hmm. Star Trek, and Harry pancake. Potter. Yep. Yeah. Star Wars, Star Trek, and Harry Potter. That's what it is. Seen so space, wait. aliens, and wizards. Is this Harry Potter? It's one? basically pimp my ride. <laughs> I said throw Hogwarts decorations. On just drove like Hogwarts. Uh, I've read, I've <laughs> read, read one, one chapter of Put the school on the <laughs> Is <it laughs> shit made out of bricks? Ooh. That'd be dope. Wouldn't yeah. fly. Would be dope. Would get uh, shot down very easily. Honestly, yep. if I got Legos for my birthday, I wouldn't be sad. Oh, I ask for Legos every single present. year. Legos are, yeah. Legos are yes, such a I, good gift. They're last timeless. year I brought Legos to the dorm and I started building it and Jimmy's like, is this real Is this real life? What do you... Get off my desk. <laughs> <laughs> we need to have Jimmy on the pod. When Jimmy no, comes back... You know, no, because no, Jimmy needs First off, I don't know if he knows that we have this. Mm. If he does, That's probably for the best. He would probably make fun of it. He would want to be on it, and when he would get on <laughs> it, when he would get on it, he would sit in the corner and just sit on his phone and just like, yeah. <laughs> no, I'll get him going. He'd throw into the occasional joke about how he likes black girls, yeah. And then that's it. And then he would just sit there and be like, "All right, thanks for having us, guys." And then he'd go home, and then he would clown Braden and Madden. So that'd be it. Dude, what is that's Jim, awesome. What is, that's what that's that's awesome. Awesome. What is hey, he look. passionate about? Like, what gets him going? Like, what's his trigger? Like, everyone has a trigger. I gotta find that trigger and push it. Uh, he's it extremely competitive. Bad. Yeah. Mm. Um, we're talking about my roommate, by the Does way. Does he have a, a, a little man complex? Like, if you call him short, will he get mad? Or, I mean, because he, he kind he, of. He's not the tallest dude. No, I mean he's tiny. He's a midget. <laughs> oh, sorry. You guys were talking about little people. I don't know if I can say. It's our, I don't know if I can drop the end. How, how, oh, by we the just way, just had a whole conversation. I listened to last week's <laughs> episode. Great, I loved it. Oh, thanks. You guys did a great job. Um, Luke carried. That was funny. Seven strikes is a lot. And that was week. You guys said if Cam was here, he'd get his ass. Beat. <laughs> <laughs> There's a reason he's not back. There. Yeah. But before we, before we continue with that, I do want to address that Colin's not here right now, but he's with us in spirit, and hopefully he joins us over Zoom call here in a few. Hours maybe, <laughs> and he might, uh, he might call in. He might call in, but you know we, we're we're ready for him just okay. in case question, he does. Question: What's up? How does this technology work here? Like, you know, <laughs> so if he talks, how's this here technology work? Zoom? You mean like no, the if, fast cars? If he if he talks, how are we gonna pick it up? Uh, what kind of engine are we talking with the Zoom? It's it's thing. gonna come in through my MacBook speaker and pick up through the microphone. Mm. Yeah, you know, it's it's all very scientific. I think. I don't know if you're like software that joined to zoom to the recording dude this is very like guerrilla warfare like yeah. you know revolutionary mm -hmm. war type mm -hmm. stuff like the philippines radios are only so good mm. yeah whatever we're giving them they're fine with so we're just going to keep giving it to them i mean hey we're killing it in the philippines right now mm -hmm. we're, we're producing steady numbers mm -hmm. it's we're like the monkey pox <laughs> it's our get, numbers are high but not everyone's pleased with it <laughs> <laughs> it's it's getting close to being our number one City mm -hmm. outside of you know mm -hmm. where we live, mm -hmm. and our moms, and our moms. Mm -hmm. Like so, my question is, who listens to this? Like, do you have nothing else to do? Like, I get, <laughs> they're called fans. They're called fans, Adam. Do you Bashing listen to podcasts? Yeah. 
You listen to this these Anyone? idiots every week? Yes. Whoever listens we, to this, we love and appreciate. Adam's got a point. You're probably really dumb. Yeah. But we appreciate your dumbness. Yeah. We we do ask you. You don't have anything else to do with your time. But we appreciate that you're spending it on us. You're yes. wasting Find it on us. Find a hobby. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. We are their hobby. <laughs> Dude, we ran into Matt Farmer at the weight room today. He says, yeah. when, when can I get on the podcast? Yeah, I was like, wait, oh, we're, we're, we're resonating we with you. We a bunch of people. That we told to him to pay. It. We, we said we, if we, he paid us, we, we would said, let him hey, on. Shoot, shoot us, 20, shoot us a 20 on the Venmo. He's for taste of others. Maybe. Yeah. Our first athlete guest. I mean, we had Luke, but I mean. I said we could get him on I mean, we had Luke, but that's not really an athlete. We could sign him for 20 bucks a week. If he shouts out the podcast. That's 20, so much that money. Is so, yeah. No, he's got to wear a sticker on his helmet. I'm no genius. Mm. <laughs> I, you know how much money it takes to make a sticker? If it's over <laughs> if it's over a nickel, we can't afford it. Yeah, out. bro. I hate to break it to you. But listen, this is an open invite to anyone who's willing to pay $50 a podcast. You're more than welcome to come on. Our Venmo is <laughs> at I'm no genius podcast. $75 and you're on anytime you want. How much? A hundred bucks and you let's can come on no matter what you let's want. Keep, let's keep raising the price as we go along. 500 is the total package. It's only $125. You can come on yeah. here and just BS with us for an hour. It's Dude. really no deal. Do you know the crazy thing? We're on Patreon. Like I, I post all of our videos on Patreon. What? What's a Patreon? I don't know what that is. A Patreon is like uh, what podcasters use, like for like exclusive content. It's an OnlyFans for podcasts. Mm. Pretty much. Mm. That's you a pay good five bucks. You pay five bucks. Five bucks a month. You get an extra episode and you get like early content. Yeah. We, right now what, we don't. What, right, what kind of early content do we yeah, have? Yeah. Right now we don't have any like extra content. That's probably why we don't have any. Mm -hmm. You know, patrons. Mm -hmm. Can we put spicy pics on there? <laughs> like peppers. Oh, okay. He's, well, we oh, hey, we oh, got oh, hey, we got peppers oh. upstairs. He's my on, my he's, mom's cooking, so he's he's got a point. He's on to something. Yeah, you, I have a story about spicy. I, I'll I'll tell it later. But yes, dude, okay. I love it. I mean, I love stories, bro. I can't wait. Speaking of stories, uh, Cam, how is prison? Mm. Mm. I'm out to clink. <laughs> Beat the system. I left some brothers in there. <laughs> I can't wait to go back. Um. Oh my. No, it was actually really. Really touching. Yeah. <laughs> Elaborate. Probably shouldn't have done there. How, how touching? <laughs> yeah, yes. Um, yeah. um, Say more. I was touched by those inmates. <laughs> and I'm pretty sure that I touched them. Um, I didn't know what to expect. I mean, we didn't have we didn't have an agenda really any day of the week. So we we get there. Take, take half. Uh, don't you dare. So... Flying to Dallas, we literally, we literally just learn everything day by day. So we get there, fly to Dallas, drive to Waco, that's where we're staying. There's eight host families, two people to the host family. The house I was staying in, shout out the Beckers and Paul. He was like, he was the son. He was a cool dude. Um, they listen? They they will. Okay. Um, they will someday. Yeah. <laughs> but they don't know yet. House was massive. Got my own room to myself, own bathroom. Jeez, dude. First day, went to church, and played at a local high school just against each other. Second day, ran a kids camp at a local community center. And then we played each other. And every night, we went to a different food place. It was really cool. Um, in and out fries, by the way, garbage. If you don't get them animal style, you're an idiot because, like, they were still bad with animal style. In, in and out burger. What did mm -hmm. you say? Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. They're fries. The burger was the burger was good. Fries are just oh, man. There's aren't my, they like really? Aren't they like steak and shake fries? They're mm, really skinny. Aren't really they? tiny. Yeah. Ooh, this I might be an unpopular like opinion. This. I'm not a huge fan of In and Out Burger. Had it twice in my life. Wasn't impressed. Oh, the first time, time I had it. wasn't wasn't impressed at all. What a burger is like Burger King. It yeah. was good. Yeah. I've never been past Wisconsin going west, so never experienced it. Too many libs. Yeah. <laughs> Texas. <laughs> Oh well, yeah, he's got a point. Okay. He's, got a point. he's got a point. He's got a point. Yeah. And if, you're, if you're listening, no. Adam is wearing a shirt that says "Keep America Great, Go Fishing." <laughs> Bass Pro Shops. Bass Pro Shops. It is go a fire fishing. shirt. Mm -hmm. Anyway, Tuesday was our first day at the prison. <laughs> we, um, the prison was an hour and ten minutes away, so we had to wake up at five, be at this church at six, and then we got in two church vans and drove to this prison. And it was a smaller prison, 3,000 inmates. And we walk up, and like, you see the movies of the barbed wire. Mm. Shawshank. That stuff's no joke. Like, it was, like, you could jump and touch it, and it looked crazy sharp. Jeez. Can't have two doors at a time, so we walk in, get patted down by the chaplain and another guard, and you can only bring in, you can only bring in your ID, 
and you have to wear the shoes you're gonna play in. So I was just wearing like outdoor shoes. And we're walking through the yard and guys are just looking at you. It was early in the morning, so there wasn't a ton of people out, but they would just look at you. Some would wave and some would just stare at you. Sizing you up. And we walk to the gym and it's, um, it's like a pool barn, like the shop at my house. And it's just a smooth concrete floor and there's six hoops and they have music playing, like loud worship music playing. And I walk in, they all just start clapping for you. And I was like, why am I smiling right now? Like, what is happening? <laughs> they all come up, they dap you up, give you a hug. And the first two days, we put them through, like, uh, different stations at each hoop. And then they rotate, and then we do team drills with them, and then we play them every day. And between that time, we'd give testimonials, talk to them. And they were actually, like, this sounds scary, like, they remember everything about you. I told I tell everyone my name once, and they remember it for the rest of the week. That's impressive. And you were, we were told before we went in, don't ask what they're in there for. But the more you talk to them, the more they would open up to you and they would tell you. And after every station, they'd shake your hand, give you a hug. It was just really cool, and they kept saying it like, stay on the path you're on right now. This is no place to be. You don't want to be here. One mistake in my life just flipped the whole thing upside down. Like, I regret it, blah, blah, blah. But it was cool because, like, 99% of those guys that were in there were going to get out. So they weren't, like, I mean, they were in there for some pretty deep stuff, like crimes of passion, drunk driving, drugs. But, um, I mean, they would, t they would tell you their story. They would connect with you. And then the last day, we got permission to bring them in pizza. And before we did all that, they sat us down in a line and, like, their, there was a field minister. He was he's an inmate, but he's like, like a step below the chaplain, and he was preaching to us whatever. And then six guys came out with water bottles and towels, and they're like, "Take your shoes off." And at first I was like, "Yo, my feet are rank, dude. Are you sure you want to do this?" <laughs> and so he took our shoes off and he, like, pulled us close. It was two, two players to one inmate. They like, pulled us in close and prayed over us, and they started, like, washing our feet. Which is like the most humble thing you could do, or whatever. Mm -hmm. And I just start, I was, I just started bawling. I was like, "Why am I crying?" Like I looked over at, we have one freshman. His name's Jaden. I looked over at freshman. I was like, "Jaden, what's happening right now?" And he was like, "It's Jesus, brother." <laughs> and I was like, "This is crazy." I was just sit there crying. The power and, of the Lord. And then they gave their testimony. It was really cool. And then at the very end of the day, they were facing one wall, and coach's friend Solomon was leading them in prayer. And he was like, "I want y'all to turn around." And we had the pizza, and they were amped. Like, started clapping, started yelling. And then there was guys that had the pizza, and they were just double fisting, just eating as fast as they can. And um, the last day they beat us because half of our guys were getting pizza, so it was just like six of us left playing, and they beat us by four. But there was some, there was some dudes in there who were smooth. But it was really it was a really cool experience. I didn't, didn't expect to like it as much as I did, but I'm glad I went. It was cool. It's not. It's oh, yeah. yeah. It's not every day you go to prison and have a good time. Yeah. But you know, hey, good for and you. And I think, like, it sounds bad, but the best part of going to the prison is being able to get out. Like, I well, could leave every day, and that's what were they. Were there all like? Was we it, were like, there the from same schedule every day. Yeah, I mean, we got there at eight thirty, and we left at one. The no AC, no AC at all Jeez. in the prison, and there's just fans, so it's like a blow dryer. And Texas isn't as humid. Yeah. It's just uh -huh. it was 110 every day. How many yeah. guys were there? It was like inmates. <clears throat> there was three thousand inmates, like for the prison itself. But every day there was a hundred guys in there. And oh, they, really? They were, in, they were from twenty-five to sixty-five. Like, did they rotate? Like, he was in there, or? Uh, no. Somebody. Just because it was only a hundred guys, oh. so they could thinking. fit them all in there. And then, like, as the days went by, like they would bring new guys in to try and beat us because we beat them the first two days by like thirty. They'd bring new guys in, but the older guys just started slowly sitting out, <laughs> sitting <laughs> out. And I would lead them in stretches or whatever, and they're like, Cam, yeah, I was doing this in my cell last night. This shit works. <laughs> and I was like, yeah, it's good stuff. He said, and the next day they come, I was like, did you do your stretches last night? He's like, nah, man, I got to sit down. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, I haven't played in four years. It was cool. Yeah. How did they decide who got to, like, be a part of it? So you had to be on good behavior for six months, yeah. and the sign-outs went to the faith-based storm first. So, like, if you're, wow. if you're willing to take, like, um, like religion classes and ministry classes, mm -hmm. you can live in the faith-based norms. And then if you weren't living there, 
after they got everyone in the faith-based norms who want to sign up, they sent it to other guys with good behavior. I mean, like, that's cool. those faith-based norms, man, that's like, if you're a new prisoner, that's where you want to be. No, yeah. Like, I mean, I you're, like, like, look, you like get Christian, like, yeah. Okay. So, you, like, you well, it's not even just Christian, it's people. So it's majority's Christian. But the chaplain has to be able to accommodate for Muslim, Muslim. Jewish, yeah. um, Hindu, like, any, anything. All, all the, yeah. All Are them. you with only Christians, or was it like everyone? I, I mean, anyone okay. could sign up, but like the message we gave was Christian, Christian, and, Christian and whatnot, yeah. and that's what they gave to us too. Gotcha. That's cool. But it was a neat experience. Glad I went. It's gone, man. Yeah, you finished those. There's no more. <laughs> Stop uh, eating food. Sorry, sorry. They did. They uh, made us patty melts one day. Really? What are those? Uh, it's. You ever had like a Frisco melt? Mm-hmm. It's just bread, buttered bread, and then a hamburger on it. Mm, oh, wow. It's a sandwich. So they made us they made us double patty first, not first good mouths, but uh, patty melts. And they came with a brown paper bag. And like you were saying last week, you didn't know if it was good or bad that it tasted like a school lunch. But it wasn't terrible. Like yeah. It, mm-hmm. yeah. It, I, I ate it. It had cheese, ketchup, and pickles. I yeah. liked it. Well, to well, be fair, yeah. you, eat you, you will I, eat everything. Exactly. Very think. true. But like everyone else ate it. And I don't know if it was because we were hungry or... But, I mean, it went down, and we one of the guys, Bubs, he got it. And an inmate came up behind him and goes, give me that burger. And he goes, <laughs> and then stuck his arm out real fast, and he's like, I'm just messing with you, man, and walked out. <laughs> I was like, oh, my gosh. Yeah, was it, was it, I'm, you didn't get confronted by anybody, or you didn't get no. scared? No. The, Coach Coons was saying the scariest part was when he was walking the pizzas through the yard. <laughs> because, like, if you weren't playing basketball, you weren't getting the pizza. And he had dudes just line up against the fence and put their arm on it and just look at him, not say a word. <laughs> Dude, that, that's that got to be terrifying. Like and then, go ahead. The second day we were, <laughs> this isn't being confronted, but the second day we were walking out, and as we were walking out, guys were like, see y'all tomorrow, bring your A game, stuff like that. <laughs> it, was, it was one dude. He was a little fruity. There was, there, was a couple, <laughs> there was a couple guys you could tell, not that were playing with was, us, but was, like as you're walking through the yard, you could tell that, was this Tracy? You know, was they this, were like the cheerleaders. They were like the cheerleaders. Yeah, yeah Tracy Morgan. Morgan. Yeah. You know. <laughs> but um, so one guy was like, we'll see y'all tomorrow. And before I say the story, if any OCU faculty is listening, it's just a quote. I'm not per- purposely dropping the F-bomb. But he goes, <laughs> he goes, Clip it. he goes, um, I'll see y'all tomorrow Bring A game. And the one guy goes, yeah, I'll see y'all tomorrow. And, and Mace goes, no, the fuck you ain't. <laughs> <laughs> it was so funny. <laughs> Whatever, back freckle. <laughs> it was funny. But, yeah, good time. Texas is hot as balls. Don't want to live there. The grass dies real fast. You got to water it every day. Yeah, who, who would want to live in Texas? But the pool's sweet. The pool? Every pool I swam in was a nice pool. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> every house I went to was a nice house. What part yeah. of Texas was this? Waco. I got to tour uh, Baylor. Mm. Baylor's awesome. Yeah, huge. Um, so you're in like a like the Dublin, like what yeah. Do you do? Like Dublin. I mean, I mean, yeah. Everywhere I went was like Dublin area. I yeah, mean, like, just rich people. You were you oil, were, you were oil sh- money. yeah oil money. You were showing my dad pictures of the Baylor gym, mm-hmm. and he said that's bigger than Ohio State. And I said we can't have that. We need to renovate. <laughs> yeah. We need to yeah. we need to expand. I mean, we saw the national championship trophy. Saw the rings. <laughs> Whatever. They have, they have a way. Didn't see that at Ohio State. They have a. Uh, we we got one. They have when a, the seventies. Plumbers. John Havlicek. Plumbers. Jerry Lucas. Plumbers. Mickey Mouse ring. We have a. They had a weight room just for men's basketball, girls basketball. They had like a kitchen in it. Hoops in the weight room for a weighted ball. It was crazy. Saw the locker room. Jeez. Um, what else? I see something crazy. I had the best barbecue in my entire life. Mm. I mean, you're in Texas, Can imagine. dude. It was it was a place called Hellberg's. Shout mm. out Hellberg's, like Wahlburgers. Sponsors. Was it like a? It was a family-owned place. Like the guy's last pop. Mm, guy's yeah. last name That's was Hellberg's. The best. Yeah, yeah, dude. Yes, any sir. any family-owned restaurant, especially if it's barbecue, is probably the best. Mm-hmm. Yes. So mm-hmm. walk in, line up. This place is like a garage. Yeah. Concrete floor, Good. picnic tables. Oh, dude. And That's the best. He, we get up there to order, and I'm talking to T. And I was like, what do you, like, let's split something. I'll get the sandwich, you get the chicken, because you can't get the chicken on the sandwich. And you ate all of it. So I got, no, Grant. I will go through what I ate, though. I got a sandwich with brisket, 
and jalapeno sausage. Crazy. It was insane. He got the smoked chicken. And bro. Oh my god. <laughs> It's just so beautiful to think about it again. Yeah. And you just take, like, if you had dentures, you could just take them out and just gum everything down. It was so soft. <laughs> they had, the chicken was crazy. T took a bite, and he's from, like, he went to Grove Fort, was, like, raised in the hood. And he took a bite, and he's like, Cam, I don't know about you, but this is the best chicken I ever had. <laughs> he said, I'm developing a southern accent. <laughs> and he, the, I got mac and cheese on the side. He came, there was... Uh, potato chips and bacon bits on it. I was like, what the heck's that? So I ate four of them. Yeah. <laughs> uh, finished the guy's sandwich, ate my half my sandwich, a big thing of chicken, for the four mac and cheeses, finished coach's potato salad, bag of chips. Um, Wait, like, and then ba- you like, went and like bag of chips or bag of chips? No, just a little personal bag of chips. Yeah. Okay. And then went to a water park. Jeez. Oh my and gosh. then after the water park, went to Chipotle. And then I I got a, a custard shake. I, I I ate terrible, but I ate so well, if that makes sense. You know what I mean? Like, it was terrible yes. for you. Everything tasted so good, except In-N-Out. All the homies hate In-N-Out. In-N-Out was just disappointing. Aren't there, like, Texas state flags everywhere, like, more than American flags down there? Yeah. Like, it's like it's No, I mean, every building you drive by, it's just painted on. It looks like great state of Texas, yeah, baby. Texas. I mean, Texas is a country. Yeah, you can't it, change it, my mind. It could about secede it. from the U.S. I mean, it did. It, 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 it did. <laughs> it could do it again, and it could thrive. Yeah, no. Every, everybody yeah. loves Texas. Yeah. Well, not everybody. Not yeah, not everyone. Some people yeah. Really hate Texas. Yeah, true. I yeah. like Texas. <laughs> but I mean, it was cool. It's just hot as balls. Wouldn't want to live there. Beautiful place. That's awesome, it was man. good. I you feel like any, I've been talking the whole time. You see any I mean, dude, we're, we're, Yeah, we're interested. Okay. You got right. to go to prison for a week. That's I did. Like, I, did. I, I was about to say that's every kid's dream, but it's not. <laughs> like, but it was awesome that you got to have that experience. I mean, it would be cool. Proud. I think it would be cool to go, like, not to go to prison, but to do what Cam did. Yeah, no, it, yeah. Was, that yeah. Would it cool. was really sweet. I mean, it's a lot It's a lot better alternative than, like, 60 Days In. You know, you know that show yeah. where, like, yeah. normal people sign up for sick. They try to join gangs, and they're, like, terrible at That's it. It's just, like, like, a bad idea. I'd yeah, like scared to hoop against them. I'd feel like I'd last foul them too hard. Yeah. No, last day was getting physical. And, no, yeah. dudes, some of our guys just started, like, like they were joking around, like, like talking crap to them. And I was like, gosh, what do we do? <laughs> Don't and aggravate them. One, the first day, like, we kind of knew them, but... Like, it was crazy how fast you got to know him because you saw him four days. It, like, not to say it was like, this sounds crazy, like, not to say it was like family, but you know what I mean? Like, it, you feel like you knew them. Yeah. yeah. But the first day, Bubs hits a three, turns around, this giant inmate, his name's Chris, giant inmate right here. Bubs sticks up a high five, and the guy just looks at him, gives him a high five, and, just, <laughs> and he just runs down the court. I was like, Bubs, what are you doing, dude? <laughs> It was fun, though. I was work j- with a lot of, like, former, like, inmates and, like, mm-hmm. ex-cons, and those guys are, like, some of the nicest people. Yeah. They just made a bad yeah. decision, I feel yeah, like. That's, I mean, that's yeah. exactly what they said. I feel like uh, I wouldn't know because I'm not an inmate, but I feel like prison, for the most part, is just, like, a humbling experience, or it's just kind of like a reset. Like, it, it resets your state of mind to, like, what life is all about. I don't really no, know. No, I mean, yeah. I, that's I, like, like I said, as I've as never as been in prison before, so I don't know for sure. I mean, as soon as, a lot of guys were saying, as soon as they got in there, the first thing they did was pick up a Bible. Yeah. And then need that Jesus. Jesus. So, I mean, the biggest biggest problem is staying with that once you get out. Right. Recidivism, rate, recidivism rates are, like, 70%. Ooh, that's big a big word. word. Yeah. What's yeah. that? Define yeah. that word. Yeah, no. When inmates get out and then get back in. You definitely learned that. Oh no! Wh- the, while, the while, while, while on the tr- while, yes, while no, on the that, was, that was not prior knowledge. Okay. Yeah. Um, Did any of your teammates try to do like a prison mic from the office mm-hmm. type thing? Like prison try to mic. try to inti- um, like put on like a purple bandana and go. You know why they call me Prison Mike? <laughs> Jimmy is Prison Mike all the time. <laughs> and the first day he was in a three point contest, and he had a, the first the inmate went first, and he made seven in a minute, and Jimmy couldn't hit anything until the last 15 seconds so he had like four in the 15 seconds left and then he would just start knocking them down and the last one everyone started counting down like five five four three two one he caught the ball 
dribbled, shot it, and then looked away, and it went in, and he just walked away. <laughs> like, Jimmy, you're crazy, dude. Are you playing like out in the yard, or where was it? It was in. It was in the barn. It was. Oh, okay. Was it like a. It was like, like a, a hardwood. It's like the shop. It was okay. a smooth concrete smooth. floor, kind of slick, but like it had lines, lines, three point lines, and then there was. It was all. It wasn't breakaway hoops. Yeah. Just like the like the stiff ones. Yeah. And Ooh, we were like playing the... with these super bouncy rubber outdoor balls. Mm. Mm-hmm. So we couldn't get a handle. Everyone's yeah. sweating because there's no AC. Yeah. It's that Texas heat, man. Yeah. There's no AC anywhere in the prison. No. I did learn. Really? The inmates sued. This is in all of Texas. Inmates sued to have AC in their prison because it gets so hot. The inmates sued? Mm-hmm. And they won. Oh. But none of the prisons have started. I mean, I'm sure some have, but a lot of them haven't started to put the AC in because it's cheaper to pay the fine to the state than it is to put the AC in. Yeah. I mean, I have mixed emotions about that, but... No, I mean, you're in prison. It's not supposed to be comfortable. It, it, it's already, yeah. like, it costs, like, tax. You're, you're not... A hundred thousand dollars a year per in, I'm pretty sure. You're not, you're not supposed awesome. to yes, want to so. stay there. Like, yeah. But... How That's did, just something uh, I learned. That, that, yeah. How'd you do in the pickup game? Did you throw down any dunks? No. Dev, Dev, was, windmills. Dev was hammering some dunks. They called him Big Red. Um, but... Fits. Yeah. I I just, I mean, just I was a role player the first three days. Last day, Ooh, La- last day you went off. Last day, I had dudes asking if I was going to the league after college. I'm dead serious. He's like, what, what you got? What you got planned after this? You think about going league, going overseas or something? I was like, no, <laughs> not, not at all. He's like, you could, man. I saw you out there. I had like 15 points in the second half. I was feeling it. I was cooking, knocking down some threes. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Hey, dude. One of my one of my favorite NBA stories is that John Stockton was planning on going overseas to play basketball before mm-hmm. he even, he ended up getting drafted into the NBA. Mm-hmm. So it could happen, man. He's no, so yeah, I mean, he what? He's up. He was on the dream team. I had, uh, I had a couple well, guys <laughs> asking if they're like, "You're my favorite player, man." I'm like, "Bro, stop, stop." And then walking, I was like, "Guys, we can't suck this year. We got a whole county of Texas rooting for us." <laughs> they're like, "Yeah," and they they would. Like that night, they would call their wife or their girlfriend, and they would get on like our website and our Facebook and yeah. like look us up. The inmates. Or the inmates would oh, call oh, their wife oh. and like they knew our number. Like they're like, yeah, we want to we want to watch every game this year. Like we get to stream it in the dorms or whatever. I was like, guys, we can't suck. Yeah. We got a whole prison rooting for us. <laughs> a little extra motivation. If you get in a yeah, fight, bro. like the other college might get a knock on the door in like six oh, months. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Maybe. We got some- there was a professional. Did you now. did you beat OCU in basketball this year? <laughs> no mob members. We don't like There's that. No mafia members in there. You sure? The, you don't they know can, that. You don't know that. You don't know that. Maybe they weren't playing basketball. True. Maybe they were fixing the games. Maybe. <laughs> but uh, there was a professional boxer in there, and like he was that's, legit because we looked sweet. him up after he told us everything. Ranked seventh internationally. Jeez, dude. In the pr- in the he was in prison. He was. When he was out, he was What's ranked. What's his name? Some Mexican name. This I is a challenge, remember. public challenge. I want it. <laughs> okay, so Rutgers, with the new NIL thing, up like New York is a big market. Mm-hmm. And for some colleges, have said, go, that's where they're at. I it's did pretty, not know that. Yeah, well, I didn't know that until oh. like a couple years ago. But up there, it's like Syracuse and Rutgers is all that there is. Powerhouse. And you see like yeah. power, two cool, powerhouses two. in NCAA so, football. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like. And this will probably end up being completely wrong, but with NIL, there could be a bunch of kids going up there now, because there's like so many companies that could just be giving them deals, and records could like start blowing up, and be like get big in like football, basketball. Maybe it makes sense. Maybe yeah, it'll probably not, be wrong. Probably not, just because they're like historically trash at everything. But <laughs> garbage. <laughs> Their uh, rowing team's pretty fire. Are they? Yeah. <laughs> Made that up. <laughs> you believe it though? <laughs> they rowing on the Hudson. Adam, not. probably probably disgusting. Yeah, probably sick. Adam, what's your uh, what's your prediction for OSU football this year? What's our record gonna be? There's 12 games in the season, correct? <laughs> yeah, uh, if, I'm not, yes. if I'm not yes. mistaken, yeah. Ten and two. Oh wow! Who yeah. who are we losing to? Yeah, we're gonna miss the playoffs. The big ones. Who and why? I'm gonna go. I need if you're gonna throw this out there, I I, I need a why. I'm gonna go. We're gonna lose to Notre Dame and Michigan, unfortunately. Okay. Hmm. Both are home. Both are home both, games. Both, Clip are, it. Home. both are home. Clip we lost it. to Oregon last year. One is the start of the season. One's yes. the end of the season. Okay. That's what defense, happened last year. Defense, yep. historically terrible at the beginning of the season. 
Okay. Although we're always, we always have bad defense at the beginning of the season. Did okay. you forget that we have Jack Sawyer at defensive end? Defense coordinator's just going to be getting settled <laughs> in. I don't think we're going to have good – I don't know that our defense is – if our defense is great this year, then I agree. We go undefeated and we make a push for the national championship. But I'm going to say 10-2. and two. Not this year. Mm. Maybe next year. But And I just feel like Michigan, like, I don't know. We looked bad against them last year. We did. And yeah. Adam and I watched that game together, and, and my mom was in the room. But the amount of cuss words I got over text message when Adam was 10 feet away from me was astonishing. Yeah. Like, that, if, if you still had to pay for every text message you sent, Adam would be so poor. I was he serious. would be dirt poor. Yeah. That game made me very, very upset. I just feel like Michigan's going to come in on a, and just beat us this year. Mm. We we did curb stomp them, like, for 10 years straight, so. Yeah. But We played like trash last year, and we still hung in there so I think I, I like your prediction I think it'll be 11 and 1 because I think we'll beat Notre Dame just because last year CJ Stroud was donkey dick against Oregon he's got to be a little better against he's, I, he's, 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 he's got to be around. settled I, 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 hope out. This year. I hope I'm wrong my rebuttal to that is you said defensive coordinator will still be settling in he's been there since like January so I, I mean just, like still I get the reps. argument He's he's done this long enough. He's like the best in the country at what he does. And plus, we didn't lose anyone on defense. We're getting everyone yeah, back. That's true. We also brought in a dude who could have went to the draft, Tanner McAllister. He uh, played under Jim Knowles. So we he's, need, he'll, he'll second, help. Secondary's got to step up. So is he the D line. Jack, like, get in there. How, what are we doing? Dog. <laughs> How are we gonna do offensive wise? I mean, we've got, we're we're gonna got, be insane. We've we're got absolutely yeah, insane. Everywhere. Who do you think? Uh, give me three key players right now. Trayvon Henderson Absolutely. is a Heisman contender this yep. year. Mm-hmm. If think, he doesn't get it this year, next year he will be a finalist. I was gonna. It was so fun to watch him last year. Super fun. I could. I. I feel like this year they're gonna air it out a lot more just because they got yeah. C.J. Stroud. Next Jackson year. Smith and the Jigba. Good. Oh, good. Good. My good. Favorite. He did it. He did it. He did it. <laughs> It's a mouthful. Oh, it's a mouthful. So close. That's deep. good, man. I took a deep breath there. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> yeah, I, I, oh. I agree, Adam. I think he's going to be a very, very big player. I'm about to buy his jersey, honestly. We got hey, 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 dude, you have to. You have yeah. to. He's been my player. Yeah. Receivers. I'll follow him to the NFL. Yeah. How do you think uh, Stroud's going to do this year? Do th- this year? I think he'll do very well. He yeah. did very well last year outside of Michigan. He, he, he is a... Uh, He's a true sophomore, right? Like he's he's a so, he's not a redshirt sophomore. He's a sophomore for real. Yes. Because oh, last no. year last year he was a true freshman, Don't right? Me. No, because he played behind Justin Fields. Do you remember the long run he had against? Yeah, yeah. yeah. He okay, was so, fourteen. Yep. So 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 redshirt sophomore then. So he'll be in the draft next year. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, hey, I'm like, look, Justin. We got off to a rocky start last year, but I'm I'm ready to see you, Justin. Who? Oh, not Justin. CJ. I, you You're got, a failure. Wow. Hey, chill, bro. Wow. Sorry, sorry. Sorry. You go I mean, to Ohio hey, State and don't okay. even know the starting quarterback's name. No, strike I know, three. I know CJ. Strike three. <laughs> <laughs> you said Justin. It got me confused. But speaking of Justin Fields, how about them Bears? Right? You think they're going to do <laughs> anything this season? <laughs> He doesn't no. have a line. Exactly. He doesn't have any receivers. The Bears Swiss are a cheese. joke over an organization. I feel bad he went I, there. I did, I did love uh, the fact that Aaron Rodgers is on Pardon My Take. Oh. By the way, quick sidebar. If you're watching this podcast, we rip off a lot of things from other podcasts. So don't tell anyone. Pardon My just Take don't is tell probably anyone. one of our biggest. Uh, pardon My Take I is, only is probably the biggest take. one. Uh, don't tell anyone. No, no, <laughs> don't do that, Adam. <laughs> Jump! But oh, big, turn it off. <laughs> but Big Cat kept uh, making fun of uh, Aaron Rodgers, like you know. I mean, there's not a lot to make fun of Aaron Rodgers for, just because he's not only a terrific player, he's also just an awesome guy. Well, no, he's hair. not. His hair, hilarious, dude. He's, he's my, I'm his a Packers hair is fan. Terrible. He's the biggest dickhead in the world, and I, I love, love it so much <laughs> because he wins. Well, not in playoffs, but he wins. No, like and like uh, Big Cat was talking about that, and he said like. My Super Bowl is when you lose <laughs> in the playoffs. That's I it's celebrate. A, I have eleven it. rings. I have eleven rings. I have more rings than you. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I love it. Super Bowl predictions. Go around real quick. Who's winning? Give me the two teams and who's winning. Watch this. I'm no genius. <laughs> but oh boy. 
Did you think of Did you think of that intro and you forgot no. to think of the no. outro? Do we want to go this way? Let's start with Adam. Let's hear it. Bills are gonna have a breakout. They're finally gonna bust through. I think the Bills. <sighs> The sexy pick is the Rams because mm. there is no Get cap. Sexy, Adam. There is no cap. It's fake. It doesn't exist. So I feel like the Rams could. I feel like the Rams have a very good shot at repeating because they McVay's have everyone. a genius. Yeah. yeah. It's just like playing Mc, yeah. uh, my team on Madden or whatever it's called. Yeah. It's ultimate team. Ultimate team, right? It. Sure. I don't. I, I get it confused. So. Whatever it is. Yeah. It's yeah. like playing that on Madden. And you can just yeah. buy coins. <laughs> yeah, just get players. Yeah, I think it could be Rams and Bills, but I think the Bills make it this year. I, I'd be pumped if the Bills made it. I like Josh Allen I like, a lot. I like Allen. Grant, I love Bengals all the way. <laughs> I don't. <laughs> Bengals are my team. I always root for them, but it's going to be tough in the AFC this year. There's so many insane. teams that could. AFC North is going to be yeah. insane. Oh, uh, it's North, and then you got teams like the Bills, Chiefs, Chargers, with that whole division over there. Dude, I'm, I'll and go the Dolphins. Bills. Dolphins, too, yeah. Broncos. Yeah. That's right. Hot take. Dude. Broncos are going to be trash. I don't think they'll be that good. I don't think Dude, they'll be that good. They'll finish last in their division. Dude, I'm rooting for the Bengals. I'm a diehard Bengals fan. And, and you know, until until the Browns are better than them, then I'm a diehard Browns fan. But, yeah, Bengals. Rolling with the Bengals. And then whoever like they the Bengals. Been. Yeah, I love the Bengals, man. I love all over them. <laughs> you know what? I'm go. taking Bengals. <laughs> go A's. Yeah. <laughs> and then, Call me crazy. Oh, okay, go ahead. Sorry, I was just gonna say yeah. NFC. Uh, I like the Bucks. It's just I, Tom I was, Brady. NFC hey, uh, look. NFC Championship is gonna be Bucks Packers. AFC Championship. Call me crazy. Bills Chargers. You know why? You know why I like that pick. Why? Keenan Allen was a dog in fantasy last year, and Justin <laughs> Herbert can throw the ball far. I'm no genius. But well, to win a football yeah, game, that's, that's two in a row. The Raiders, <laughs> you know, uh, Daniel Carlson kind of. I don't want to talk he, about uh, it, dude. He ended both your season and the Charger season he last did. year. He did in one kick. He did. Yeah. Mm-hmm. He did fantasy. But it, it's a new year. Two time. It's a new year. Uh, hy- hypothetical. Um, if uh, well, I guess it's not a hypothetical since it could actually happen. If Tom Brady wins another Super Bowl, that would be number eight, yeah. right? Is he the greatest football player of all time? He was already. He was already the already greatest is. football of all time. He already is. Five. It ain't five close. Super Bowls. So really? I don't. I don't. I don't know who's better. Like who's better? Yeah. I mean, I like, uh, there's always the Joe Montana. You throw Peyton Manning in that conversation. The no. reason Brady's so good is because he's played in so many different eras of football. Like yeah. Montana he's, played he's, '80s football where it was run heavy. Brady has played through all levels where it was run heavy all the way up to where he could just sling the rock. Yeah, Brady has, like, the most diverse championships. Yeah, I mean, I like, guess you can make, like, a Lawrence Taylor or Jerry I mean, it's hard Rice to say argument, it's hard to say the like, greatest football player of all time for football because there's so many different positions. Yeah, yeah. And, like, Brady by far has, out of all the people that we just listed, he's had the longest career. Oh, yeah. He's, he's in his 40s. He, he's, he's, he's in his 40s, mid-40s. Jesus. Like, you know, Jerry Rice, how long did Jerry, Jerry play? He like, played until he was about 41. 41. Yeah. 41. Really? And he was yeah. cooking. And, yeah. And That's crazy. I, I didn't I didn't expect that. But I know Lawrence Taylor played for, like, 10 years maybe. Yeah. That was about it. But he like, was also on crack and a bunch of other he stuff. He was a monster. No, he, he was, was a monster, he was, bro. You got to do what you got to do. How about you want to win, huh? Wasn't he, he was a mouse, massive uh, alcoholic also. Like Probably. He, well, I mean, like he had he's a massive guy. All that abuse and, like, yeah. I feel like it do something to your head. And he's dead, isn't he? No, no, he's still alive. Lawrence Taylor's? Yeah, he who was, am I thinking of? I'm thinking of the guy who played for the, the Commanders. Got shot. Safety. Uh, Sean, Sean Taylor. Taylor. Yeah, that's mm-hmm. what I'm thinking of. Yeah, he's well, dead. Yes, he R- is. R.I.P. R- 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 sad. R.I.P. R- Lawrence Taylor was in the uh, you know the two Bills documentary on Thirty oh, for Thirty yeah, yeah, yeah. with uh, Bill Belichick and Bill Parcells. Yeah, that was a good one. Yeah. So like you know that's. I have a fun hypothetical we could do. Okay. If, if if you guys have more to talk about, go ahead and talk about. I was going to say Eli, if, uh, uh, we may have an open spot in our fantasy league this year, so I'm down. Sign me up. That was easy. That. Okay. Yeah. Hey. Hey. Continue. Look. Done and done. Yep. Okay. okay. Two time. No, we, 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 <laughs> we, we do have. Hey, that. as long as I don't place last, you know what I'm saying. Mm. I still haven't gotten paid for. I've offered to do my punishment like seven times this summer. Yeah. No. And, Things are going to get real spicy tonight in the group chat. And I'm, I said it the other day, it's actually going down tonight. At this point, it's Bengals not on me. I've given no, several Saturdays. No, it's not on you at all. Things are going to get heated tonight. Stay tuned. Damn it. 
it. If you're in the Philippines. <laughs> it's not just well, baits. So here's a fun little hypothetical that I was thinking about when I was in Eli's shower. Let's Eli, great shower. Thank you. How's the water pressure? Um, did you get a good pee great. in? I did pee in a shower. Mm -hmm. That's fine. Right on the wall, spelled my name. It's not weird. I don't mind. Um, the shower cleans itself. No, you have so. to pee after the shower, that way it just sits there. <laughs> that's so, <laughs> that's that's so terrible. That's so bad. Okay, so... Linemen, I hope my mom doesn't listen to this. Off, <laughs> I'm just kidding. It'd be in your shower. <laughs> Offense and linemen, you don't. I mean, there's great ones, but you don't really remember them. So if you were to take, say, three receivers, a tight end, a running back, and a quarterback, if we assign them a number, like a jersey number, you had to make the greatest team of all time with just that number. Does that make sense? So like, no. I gave the quarterback number one, running back number two. And then the, rec so you have to pick the receivers, the three, four, five. Number one. Yes. And then a tight end, like oh. 88. Uh, I don't. don't well, we can look it up. We do. No, we like, can look it up. Numbers are tough for me. I, yeah. I'm not good with numbers. But If you, you want know. to do what we can, I was just thinking about while I was peeing in Eli's shower. Well, we, we, could, could, we could do that. We could just do names. We got to do research. I was going to say. Yeah. yeah. We were talking about fantasy. Okay. What if we just have a quick little. Quick little fantasy draft? Fantasy draft. We do a. Nope. Not tipping my hand. That's facts. You you've won Sounds two years in a row. You're not going to win. I have a strategy. I'll, stop, stop, nope. stop. I'll let you know. Instead of fantasy players, let's do let's uh, do <laughs> something not football. Okay. <laughs> Here, no, no, no. Non-football athletes, but we pick to play them football to play football. So we do Ooh, quarterback, running okay, back. Okay, okay, okay. From we'll any do, time period. In the history, uh, sure. yes, any yes, time, yes, sure. Yes. Okay, history. okay, yes. okay. Yes. Yes. Actually, it doesn't have to be an athlete. Let's just make this as crazy as possible. All right. You could you could draft Angelina Jolie as Give your tight end if you want. <laughs> Give me Jesus. What's what are you gonna do? Okay. He could like steal. 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 <laughs> Hold on. No, All right. Get the first For the second pick, I want Pontius Pilate. <laughs> okay. So we got Batman. quarterback, <laughs> running back. Give me Moses. What is stack? You want to do wide receiver? <laughs> he will part the all the no, defense. Let's do. <laughs> That's Tried another in. sack by Moses. Flex. It's seven thousand on the day. Defense. We uh. And they give Moses uh, twenty parts the defense. <laughs> Touchdown. Uh, Quarterback, running back. Wide there's receiver, one receiver. We, okay, yeah, yeah. I mean, defense. We don't need yeah, a kicker, yeah, do we? Yeah. Yes. Kicker. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> if you right. can't tell, we plan out every episode before we do it. Yeah. We'll do, yeah. We'll do a snake draft. Okay. Do you want to just do you want to just go this way? I'll, I'll go last since I know nothing. Um. Yeah. Thank I'll, you. For uh, it. I, I, I will. I will. Hey, you're going third. You're going second to last. So, <laughs> okay. um, Grant, give us a cue. Give give us someone. With my first overall pick, I will take tight end LeBron James. Mm. Good one. Now what? I my notes. Else, I can write this now, down. They, I don't hate it. First off, they cannot be uh, football players. Can't that, be football that, players. Cannot be football. Good. Good. What about? Uh, how about just uh, cannot be professional? Hold on, can players. we take a pause? Can I call Colin real quick so he has time to text us, but he can't join the podcast? I mean, you. Find. Suspended. <laughs> Suspended. <laughs> I mean, you can if you want, but. Wait, how are we going to do defense? Is it just one player? Pick a group. Pick a an group? army. <laughs> like, a, like a band. <laughs> yeah. Oh, okay. man. I, yeah. No, I'll pick I've, the Persian <laughs> army. <laughs> Wait, no, I have a group. That I'm picking for my defense. Okay, um, so which are we going this way? It's Adam. Adam's up next. Adam. Okay, Adam, take it away. What is it? Quarterback, running back. Quarterback, running back, wide receiver, tight end, flex, defense, kicker. Can I pick Jesus? Is that allowed? Yeah, but uh, he was sure. part God, Anyone. so like. Okay. Give me Jesus is at he quarterback. Give more fantasy points than LeBron. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe. What, right. are you, what are you gonna do when the water on your sideline turns to wine? <laughs> And, and your players are just hammered. Everyone is just out of their mind. All right. Oh, okay. I'm uh, up. Yes. Grant, can you write mine down? Oh for wait, me I got. I got my, my, my phone's up there. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. Okay, my first pick. I'm gonna go. Mm, this is tough. I'm gonna go tight end. I'm gonna go Abe Lincoln. Six okay. six. What? Yeah. Tall, lengthy. He's a Kyle Pitts type. He was a wrestler, so you know he can block. He was a lumberjack. Too. He was a lumberjack. Um, he's he's a he'd be a great team captain. He's going to unite the team. Yeah. I don't hate that pick because it's mine. <clears throat> okay. All right. I like so, my own uh, pick. Yeah. I'm I'm going to draft an athlete 
unlike you two imbeciles. Dude, Lincoln was arrested. Wait, who did, who did, uh, who I did you I drafted Jesus. 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 Yeah. <laughs> He's my quarterback. Right, yeah. yeah. Uh, I'm going to go with... Uh, I'm gonna go with Mike Tyson at running back, dude. dude. A solid pick. Who is tackling him? Pick. Who is tackling him? I feel like he'd be scaring the defense. No, What's gonna like happen he'd... when Mike squares up to you when you go to tackle him? That's and a 15 yard personal foul. Next one, you're out of the game. The <laughs> True. True. You gonna call uh, unnecessary roughness on Mike Tyson? I didn't think. We've so. talked about yeah. this before. I have a problem with eating punches. <laughs> Give me Mike Tyson in the if ring. If Mike Tyson said some dumb stuff, I take that back. I'm not going to confront Mike Tyson. Yeah. I, it would be an honor to be punched no, in the face honestly, by Mike Tyson. I if I got punched in the face by Mike Tyson, Tyson, I would. that would become my personality. I would tell that story no matter where you I went. You have to. Yeah. yeah. Be like, did you get punched in the face by Mike Tyson? I'd be like, Tyson? Mr. Mike Tyson, please punch me in my mouth. <laughs> <laughs> So when we're really 21 in Vegas and we see Mike Tyson, we have to piss him off and we have to fight him. Yeah. Even yes. if he's 70 plus years old. Yes. Just like you beat that guy up on the plane. Yes. Adam, bro, if you, oh, it'd be an honor to be that guy. Yeah. I'm gonna I, fight Mike. That Tyson guy doesn't know how lucky he is. <laughs> okay. <laughs> we're, we're we're back to me, right? Because it's snake yep. draft. Yes. Yep, yep, yep. Yeah, yeah. Okay, coming back this way. Um, for my <sighs> man, this is tough. This is hard. I don't know. For my quarterback. I need a tough quarterback. I need someone who's fought in a war. I need someone who's led a nation. Mm -hmm. I need Theodore Roosevelt. Mm -hmm. A well, bolder pick would it be if you picked Franklin. That's a canceled pick. Dude can't even stand up. <laughs> <laughs> I, I thought Franklin. I thought Theodore was in the wheelchair. And <laughs> no, that, that's 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 FDR. <laughs> no, that's that's FDR, oh bro. God. All right, we'll keep. We got like. A bunch um, of picks left. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Call me crazy, but I'm taking a kicker in the second round. Ooh, might be a reach. Steve Irwin. <laughs> reach. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I don't explain. What's your reasoning? Was, wait, was he the crocodile guy? Yeah. 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 Why? Okay. Kicker? I don't understand. Um. Rest in peace, by the way. We love you. Because he didn't R. kick R. the stingray. I don't think he did not kick the stingray. I don't think he can be valuable anywhere else. But he's got to be a great glue guy. I mean, who's in a bad mood around Steve Irwin? That is so true. true. You know what I mean? And I'm sure if... And you don't need... If he gave it your college... Oh, that was British. If he gave it your <laughs> college try and, like, if he gave practiced it old college to try. Up, I mean, I'm sure he played... He's got to play soccer in Australia. I'm sure he's Probably. kicked a rattlesnake a time or two. Yeah. I don't kick. My my team doesn't kick, so... Okay. We don't. But Steve Irwin at kicker, because I can't think of a quarterback. Interesting. Right. I'm going to go tight end. I'm going to go the rock. Okay. I don't uh, think he's, he has zero hands. No, I'm calling right now. He can't catch a cold. <laughs> no, a, but The Rock actually played. He played. Like he played in Miami. He played defense. in Miami. He played yeah. defensive end in Miami. Okay. I feel like he could play a little. He, I'm, sure. He was, I'm sure he could. He was he's, the, he's a big boy. Yeah, he was there on the championship team in '87, maybe. I can't remember the year, but he won a championship there. I'm about to just win this draft right here. Cap. I'm gonna start with my wide receiver. Don't pick who I'm gonna pick. I hope it's not him. Usain. Oh my! That was my next pick. That is crazy. Pick. That, so is, that is excellent choice. Excellent choice. Bolt. And then I'm gonna take my defense. Oh, I'm gonna get a big dude. What? Arnold. One guy. One guy. Yeah. yeah. One guy. We said a group. Oh, we said oh, group. A group. Oh, yeah. Pick a group, okay. bro. Oh. Uh, okay. The expendables. Just a group of Arnold. Okay. <laughs> a group of Arnold. Um, Five Arnolds. <laughs> you know what? No. I'm sticking with my pick. <laughs> Arnold, the, I'm gonna throw the, him. The Terminator at running back. Arnold. Oh, uh, Arnold. He's at a again, zero hands. I don't think he can hold on to a football. He's a running back. We're not. We're, we're gonna be a. a uh, he's got no legs. He'll, he'll be a blocking back. Okay. <laughs> he's a fullback. Nice. nice. <laughs> All right, Adam. To you. I'm gonna pick my defense. The 300 Spartans. <laughs> oh, that's great. That's an insane. Dang it, dude. <laughs> Oh. What are you gonna do? What, what are you gonna do? Really? Yeah. Usain Bolt is not running past them. <laughs> yeah. Three. Well, this is is three hundred of yeah. them. So. Well, there's just eleven on the field at a time, but they just keep rotating in and out. Yeah. All right. Quarterback. This is not because of the movie. This is just because I'm. I, he's a sneaky good athlete. Adam Sandler. Mm. Love sports. No sports. I think he'd be quarterback. Hell of a quarterback. He's, he's, oh. he's got yeah, the that's that's good pick. He's yeah, got the yeah, intelligence. He's got the experience yeah, too, even if those are movies. Yep. I count those game yep. experience. Yep. Okay. Um. Who do, who do I need next? Okay. I've got. 
got to think of a wide receiver. Need a good wide receiver or or def or a defensive. You got some options here. Or defense. I do. No. Or a defense. Um. Oh. Okay. For my defense. <laughs> oh. Uh. For my defense, I'm gonna go with the. 1989 mm. Bad Boys Pistons. Mm. I like it. That's a good pick. Yeah. That's a good pick. They were dirty. Get, get Isaiah Thomas at they free safety. All right. Just chalk block people I like all it. game. All I right. Like and I, I got a back to back. Jeez. Yeah. Um, I need a tight end. Need a tight end. I'm going to go with. Um, have any of you seen Game of Thrones? Uh, no. Uh, sure. Okay, well, there's a character on the Game of Thrones called the Mountain. <laughs> ah. Thor Bajorberson, whatever yeah. his name is. Right? Yeah, we're going with the Mountain for from Game of Thrones. Yeah, for what position? For a tight end. Mountain dude. Again, zero hands. Dude, do you dude, think that matters? Abe Lincoln. <laughs> exactly. Abe Lincoln. <laughs> zero leadership All right, appeal. Let's hear. Where, where are you going? What's his approval rating? Seriously. All right, wide receiver. <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna take a receiver here. Oh, I should have put my flex. I don't think anyone's going to take my flex. I'm going to go receiver. I'm going to go Jalen Brown. Plays for the Celtics. I'm aware who he is. Yep. He just looks like a receiver. Mm. Tall, fast, shifty. Hey, well, I mean, I'm not going to say <laughs> it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Adam. I like it. Yeah. <laughs> I like your style. <laughs> oh, I got to think. Grant put Mountain Dude in my tight end. <laughs> <clears throat> I gotta pee so bad. Go, go. BRB. Hurry back. You're on the clock. Adam, make your pick. Dun, 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 dun. Man, I gotta think because I, Usain Bolt really screwed up my whole wide receiver situation. Yeah. Um. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Who was that? Excuse, <laughs> excuse me. So sorry. <laughs> you know what? Am I flex? Nope, he played. He played football. Who are you thinking about picking? Deion Sanders. Uh, yeah, yeah, he, yeah, he, 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 I was going to put him I at must, running back, I and I was like, Bo. And Bo Jackson. Yeah, I was like, yeah, wait, yeah. wait, he yeah. would make a good football might, player because yeah. he did play football. Yep, yeah. he was pretty good at Stop. it. Stop. Stop. Did I, he just say Bo Jackson? No, no he, he, he almost Deion. picked Deion. He, he, he almost picked Deion. But like, he kind of played. Kind of a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> he, he was okay at the, the football. Yeah. yeah. He, he did the football. He did, he did, he did, he did the, football. the football. You got a mm. pick? Five. Four. Flex. Three. Giannis onto the Kumba. That's wow. Crazy. Say that one more time. That's a crazy pick. Giannis onto the That's a great pick. Dude. On Teta Kumba. Oh, he almost went two for two. Yeah. <laughs> I like Giannis. it. That's good a good pick. pick. It is a great pick. He is super fast. Super fast. Um, I forgot what I'm going to do. Oh, I remembered. Okay. We will... Start with defense. We'll go the 13 colonies and the <laughs> Revolutionary War. Okay. <laughs> Yo, I like it. I the, like it. The biggest military that is in the, the world. The biggest upset the, of all time. The states trying to unite. They yep. whoop they ass. <laughs> <laughs> so we'll go with them. Jeez. And then for my kicker, I will go with Cristiano Ronaldo. Excellent pick. Mm. Excellent. I, I picked I, Steve Irwin. <laughs> <laughs> I did not think to draft an actual professional Damn soccer player. Damn it. <laughs> Dude, I'm cooking. Yeah, right. My team is oh. dirty. Adam, you are up. I like I'm not doing shot. anything against my defense, so I don't care. No one's scoring on my team. Yeah. <laughs> the, three, the 13 colonies? Yeah, the 13 Give colonies. me the 300 Spartans versus 13 colonies. Game over in five Cam, seconds. Cam has Sweet. yet, Cam has yet to pick his defense. Yeah. I got my defense. I'm ready for it. It's gonna be like I gotta the Beatles. Think the <laughs> so I'm gonna go the Beatles. Wide receiver. Zeus. No, it's gotta be. A, it's gotta be a real <laughs> human being. Vito. Is he the one that said Dion? He tried to say Dion. Yeah, he said, yeah. he's, he's, he's running all. That's strike two. Mm, running back. Muhammad Ali. He's fast. I would play that receiver. Lightning quick. Yeah. I'm running back in the hard all right. mm. Okay. Is this because I drafted Tyson? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> He's countering. How do you spell Muhammad? <laughs> yeah. Moo? M O O. Muhammad Ali. <laughs> Why can't you say it like that? It spelled it. Muhammad Ali. Muhammad Ali. 
All right. Okay. Cam. I just thought of a terrible defense, but I'm not going to say it. <clears throat> they played in a crazy era. The 40s. All right, my flex. <laughs> I'm going to take the dark ages. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. We're not going to go oh. deep into it. Well, We're not going to talk about it. Say it. Oh. Think about it. Oh, no. My flex. Damn. I'm going to go an athlete. Kind of wouldn't. I, I just remember this from like sixth grade. I'd wake up in the morning, 7 a.m., and turn on Sports Center. And they said that this guy was the fastest player in baseball at the time. Mookie Betts. Mm. Yeah. For what? What position? Flex. Flex. Okay. Mm. I like Mookie it. Mookie Betts. Dude, he's it's like an all pick. world. Uh, mm -hmm. Bowler, also. Mm -hmm. Ooh, you just mm -hmm. you just gave me a great idea for my mm -hmm. flex. Let's hear it. Ichiro. Wow. Stop. Interesting. He might. The guy he might the die. Mm -hmm. He's tiny and so old. What? He's, He's so tiny. fast, dude. I remember playing uh, with. Uh, it was I think I believe it was MLB 2K 13. Okay. And <clears throat> Ichiro was the leadoff hitter for the American League. Uh, all-star team and uh, I would just bunt with him it would be like the worst bunt ever and he would get there before the catcher even picked it up so yeah I'm going, my, I'm going with him I got my receiver I need I need a wide receiver or a kicker um, let's go with a kicker uh, I mean I might as well go with wait a second no I know who I want I want um Odell Beckham Jr. as my kicker. He's a football player. I'll allow he's it. Oh, oh, oh what? no! Oh, okay, yeah, you're right, you're right, you're right. No, he's a football player. We he, can't. he is a football player, but he doesn't play he kicker. Doesn't play. I forgot about that, yeah. We can't allow it. Uh, fine. That's a good pick, though, because he likes soccer. He does. He loves He, he, he was, he he was kicked like... kicked the shit out of the, uh, <laughs> he, the little <laughs> yeah, the net, too. <laughs> he was, I would have taken Kareem Hunt, but... I'm right. pretty... <laughs> I thought, I thought about that. I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty sure uh, Odell Beckham was like an either All-State or like All-American in yeah. soccer. Really? I'm 90% sure. Uh, that might be false. I don't know. No, no. But okay. uh, yeah, I'll just pick Lionel Messi as my kicker. Uh, that's all right. It, it's it. You know, I wish I knew more about soccer. Who's but better, I don't. Ronaldo or Messi? Messi. I know absolutely on what. nothing about it's, soccer. It's like the LeBron, Jordan. But yeah, they play the They're completely era. different. I guess different it's like positions. LeBron and KD, maybe. Yeah, but kind of like better. Comparing. LeBron is better. Thank you. Okay. Mr. That. Primer. Okay, I'm going to go for my defense. I'm going to take Genghis Khan and all of Mongolia. <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty. Because not only. <laughs> Genghis Khan got around. So I'm never going to have. I mean, I'm going to. You got have, numbers. I'm going to have first string, second string, third string, fourth string. I, I'm going to go. No I'm one deep. knows who he's buried either because they exactly. killed the guy who's buried him and exactly. then killed the guards who killed them. Exactly. Right? I'm deep. And defense. he's just ruthless. He's the one that brought horses to Asia. Dude, sweet. What can I say? Yeah. Good pick. <laughs> Thanks. Wide receiver, Jesse Owens. Oh, good like, pick. That's a good I, well, He's a speedster. Is, if speedster, ju speedster, long jump. Mm -hmm. Look, as a guy, as a fellow, the Ohio State man, uh, uh, <laughs> great pick. Great okay. guy. What can I say? Great pick. If you took Bolt, I was going to take Owens, so it's, it's good. I like it. Yeah. Okay. I need a quarterback. You do. I'm taking white chocolate. <laughs> Jason Williams. That's a phenomenal <laughs> pass. That's a crazy pick. <laughs> phenomenal Dude, pass. Dude, Grant killed this draft. <laughs> and then for my flex, I think he's a he's a dual threat. He can do just about anything. I'm taking Harambe. Wow, dude. Wait, he's, wait hold, wait, on, hold, hold, on, hold on, on. Hold on, hold on. We said real you people. Said no to we could say no to Zeus. What do you mean? <laughs> he said it's a gorilla. We, <laughs> 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 we didn't say no animals. <laughs> I would have said, said no to Zeus. We said real people. We should have established this prior. <laughs> I would have picked the cheetahs by running back. He said it's a gorilla. All right, well, I need a second now if we're saying no. Yeah. <laughs> Take your time. Take the kid who Harambe stole. <laughs> <laughs> Harambe did nothing. Harambe yeah. was protecting the kid, Loki. Rest it in peace, our sweet prince. <laughs> yeah. Things went downhill after that, man. Facts. Uh, I, I want to keep Harambe. I don't care. <laughs> I don't pay, care. Yeah, pay the fine. I had pay the fine ready. to keep Karate. <laughs> I'll take the I'll take the two game penalty. I don't care. All right, Adam, stick with what's it. What's your What's your final pick? He's not taking Harambe. <laughs> Watch me. This is a fantasy draft. Give me nothing. Zeus for my kicker. <laughs> <Yes. laughs> you already, sure, you, you know, already have Jesus, one God per team. Yeah. Yeah. 
I got Harambe, you got <laughs> Jesus. That is a <laughs> kicker, Gabriel, the lead angel. The hell did you just say? <laughs> Gabriel. 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 I'm kidding. Um, oh, I need a kicker. Well, my team's not gonna kick, but uh. <laughs> so this does not so matter. So we need a good glue guy. I'll trade you the pick for Steve. <laughs> I'm gonna take Kevin Hart as my kicker because mm. he's just gonna be on the sidelines the whole time. We don't kick, we go for it. Fourth and yeah, that's talking, a good pick. Talking Come Robert, camaraderie. It's a good yeah, pick. I like yeah. it. Camaraderie. Yep. Okay. I need a running back. He's my last pick. I'm gonna go the person who killed Nicole Brown Simpson. Oh. <laughs> um. Who could that be? No one knows. Uh, <laughs> no, one, no one knows. This it was either uh, it was Vito. E- it was either a stranger or the one of the greatest running backs for the Bills. You can't. Or, Orenthal James. He can't. He can't go to. Los Angeles now because he's scared he that might he, might, he might sit next to the killer. Yeah, they could be out there. Are we going to allow that? <laughs> Look, sure. we allowed Harambe. Well, yes! we, might, we might as well. <laughs> like. Who? The murderer <laughs> of, of Nicole Brown Simpson. OJ. But <laughs> he's a football player. No, no, well, no we one knows who killed is. Nicole Brown Simpson. <laughs> but we do know who if killed. The love fits. <laughs> The jury right. was on Eli, crack. wrap it up here. I've got, um, I've got a wide receiver. Give us an explosive athlete. I, I need quite the athlete. This is tough. This is tough. But I'm, I mean, look, I'm surprised he hasn't been taken already. <laughs> the last pick of the draft. <laughs> <laughs> I was, look, I'm surprised. Like, look, this guy's, this guy's an absolute steal. I need his airness, Michael Jordan. I was, I was gonna pick him. His oh, massive sorry. hands. You think he's gonna drop a ball? Mm-hmm. I don't think so. <laughs> Not when he sees my defense, he will. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, the three hundred Spartans. I forgot about that. Putting up no <laughs> numbers against the fifteen colonists. All right, yeah. That was a, that was a, that was a good draft. That was fun. I like that was that I like that a lot. Yeah. That was. Harambe's that, bullshit, but we don't talk about it. <laughs> I can't have Zeus. Zeus. You don't get Harambe. Matt, Who, who's yeah. the one you? Oh, you took Jesus. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. Who took Jesus? That was Swiss, you, right? Yeah. Swiss Army knife. <laughs> yeah. He's like Debo. Like he's, he's a jack of all trades. So Jesus yeah. could throw the ball to himself like above Debo. the defense. <laughs> yeah. He's kind of like a whole team. Yeah. Yeah. He yeah. brings. He brought a dude back from the dead. <laughs> his, his fan base your, is insane. Your team's, your team's gonna have no injuries. His fan One. base is crazy. No, like, the healthiest team of all time. Yeah. Yeah. Ain't doing nothing. Against You're gonna sell out every single game. <laughs> you know. Oh, that was that was that turned in from a hypothetical into a full on snake draft, Love which it. I loved. loved. That was loved that was amazing. Awesome. Good draft. Can we put a poll um, on Instagram? So oh, we have to. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I already oh, screenshot oh, of my thing. I yeah. screenshot of my thing yeah. too. Yeah. Send Eli. me those. Send me those lists. I'll Please. make a, I'll make a graphic of it. It's gonna be sublime. Right so on. So when I get to heaven, we're gonna. Set and I want this up. everything mine says because my I have some pretty long ones. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So just make them tiny. Make them. Yeah, yeah, I got you. I got you. Appreciate um, it. Um, boys, I think it's about time. Yeah, I'm hungry. Didn't late. We wrap it. You, hey. You want me to sing a song? Please Dude, sing a song. birthday tomorrow? We have yeah, to. Okay, fine. I, I got to get my guitar. One day. One, one day until Eli beats Teen Pregnancy. No, they don't know what this yeah. is. We, we planned this before. Colin's not here what? to max out. To, you'll, you'll like yeah, the song. Colin's, Send us off. Colin's not here to max it's out. It's not an actual song. It better uh, be an actual Eli it is, song. It is, You're uh, going to love it. Dude, it song. better be Don't Blink. If it's not Don't Blink, I'm raging. Dude, it's an Eli classic. <laughs> God, you actually play if you're still here listening, we appreciate you. Yes. I'm going to learn Philippines for you guys. Phil- Filipino. Something. That's an only <laughs> new song. Old man being interviewed. Turning 102 today. Come on. Asked him what's the secret to life. Mm. He looked up from his old pipe. Laughed and said, All I can say is, Give it to me, come on! Don't Don't blink, cause just like that, you're six years old and you take a nap and you wake Wake up and you're 25 and your high school sweetheart becomes your wife. Don't blink, you just might miss your babies growing like mine did. Turning into moms and dads, next thing you know, you better have. Of fifty years as they read, and you pray to God takes you instead. Trust me, friend, a hundred years goes faster than you think. So don't blink. Thanks, guys. Yeah, See you thank next you so week. Much. We appreciate it. We love you guys. <laughs>